state on the record. Judge Nelson was contacted. He's now on call judge this week for, for warrants. Uh, he was contacted last night by Port Authority police officers and detectives. Uh, was provided this information. Uh, granted probable cause telephonically. Uh, set bail telephonically. And, and you guys are going to tell from the, the complaints. The, uh, the officer who received that information from Judge Nelson wrote the bail uh, in, in Judge Nelson's name. And it's just a, a, it looks like an oversight that he didn't click, uh, check the box. Uh, as Your Honor said, Judge Nelson confirmed that there was probable cause. He found probable cause for these warrants. And Judge, that should be the end of the story. And if the counsel intends to make any bail argument, we were here three hours ago. There's no change of circumstances. The state's argument remains the same. Judge, with all due respect, then, I think we're entitled to a probable cause hearing based upon the representations by Mr. Zuba. As much as I believe in Mr. Zuba's integrity, the fact is we're, we are entitled to a probable cause hearing. And since, in fact, we don't have a signature here, I think we should have one, Judge. But for, but for the, and I, I for, forgive me for this word, but for the hoopla surrounding this case, th this case is really just a gun possession case. Let me let me stop you. Yeah, and simple, but my only concern is is that sometimes the law isn't applied equally across the board. I've stood in this very courthouse and it were an individual who had no prior record who was charged with attempted murder shooting someone where the prosecutor stood up here and argued that there was a videotape of the shooting and he was entitled to the 10 percent his bill was 150,000 with 15 with 10 percent cash option that could be one we're in a different state different laws different jurisdictions secondly the, the exceptions apply when someone is transporting weapons from their uh, office to home or vice versa uh mr lisa's client lives in pennsylvania has his gun range in pennsylvania i think the court has heard the arguments and they would object to further argument on the <laughs> You know what, Judge? I'll, I'll rest. Thank you. Thank you, Your Honor.